Hello everyone, in this video I'll show you how you can easily calculate the surface area of a cube. So that's how our cube looks like, right? It's got six faces and all the faces are made up of squares, right? And I've labeled one of the sides as S as shown in the diagram with the arrow, right? That's one side and that's equal to the length of each side, right? Um, now it's very important to remember that all the faces are squares and why is it important is because squares with squares all the sides are the same right and that's what we'll use um, in order to calculate the surface area of a cube so that leads us to the formula um, which we can use to calculate the surface area of a cube and that is equal to 6 multiplied by s squared now 6 is used because as i mentioned earlier a cube has six faces in total right and it's multiplied by s squared s comes or s denotes one of the side lengths of the cube and we use squared because um, we're trying to calculate the surface area first of all of a square right because each of the faces of a cube is made up of a square so when we do s multiplied by s or one of the side lengths multiplied by the other side lengths which are the same anyways it gives us the surface area of one of the faces of the cube right one of the squares of the cube and that amount is then multiplied by 6 because a cube has 6 faces and that's the formula to use in order to calculate the surface area of a cube now let's move on to do um, an example and see how we can actually calculate the surface area of a cube using this formula so in this example given a side of 4 centimeters find the surface area of this cube right so one of the side lengths of this cube is four centimeters now we'll use the same formula that we um, discussed earlier so surface area is equal to six times s squared so we'll write down the formula first it's always um, important to write down the formula first so you know what calculations you need to do right so surface area sa is equal to 6 multiplied by s squared now 6 because the cube has six faces now what is the length of one of the sides that's four centimeters right so we'll have to do four squared so that gives us six multiplied by now four times four or four squared is 16 and if we do 16 times 6 that will give us a total of 96 okay so that's 96 now remember the length is given in centimeters so for any area calculation you need to give the unit of measurement so in this case it's centimeters and it needs to be squared so the answer we have is 96 centimeters squared which is the surface area of this cube sometimes a question can also provide you with the surface area um, amount but ask to find the length of one side of a cube right so in this example given the surface area of 96 centimeters squared find the length of one side of this cube now this question is very similar to the previous one uh, in terms of the answers that we'll get but um, it's slightly different in the sense that it's already provided an amount for the surface area but it wants you to calculate or find the length of one side of this cube right so let's try and do this so we'll use the same formula surface area s a is equal to 6 multiplied by s squared now in this question we're trying to find the s right surface area is already given as 96 which is equal to 6 
multiplied by s squared now um, if you have learned how to find the subject of formula in your maths um, classes so far you'll know how to do this um, or solve this equation right and it's very simple um, on the right hand side you have 6 multiplied by s squared you'll need to move the 6 to the left hand side right and in order to do that because it's multiplied on the right hand side you need to divide it on the left hand side so you'll do 96 divided by 6 okay which will give you 16 and that will cross off 6 from the right hand side leaving you with s squared now in order to remove the squared sign you need to square root 16 right on the left hand side because you need to leave or make s the subject of formula so once you square root 16 the answer you get is 4 so 4 is one side and because the unit of measurement is in centimeters your answer is 4 centimeters right so that's how you answer these type of questions you'll need to make s the subject of formula so just to recap the formula to calculate the surface area of a cube is equal to 6 multiplied by x squared we use 6 because a cube has 6 faces and s is one of the side lengths of the cube thank you very much for watching please share and subscribe for more